can't deal with primitive minds. Hello everyone, welcome to In The Armchair. Today we're taking a trip to Bollywood. We're going to review Serious Men. Before we get into that though, please hit the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. The lead character is played by Nawazuddin Siddiqui. Essentially the father is not happy with his place in society. His son, however, is a boy genius. So he tries to capitalize off of his fame, but there's a secret that he's hiding. That's about as much as I can say about the film without giving away spoilers. What are serious men? According to Iron Man, serious men are people that are just going about their lives, delivering presentations about things that people don't really care about. One of his examples was men giving presentations about whether condoms should be dotted or not. You know these sort of people in life. You've probably seen them on the TV, encountered them in real life, think they know everything about everything, but they're talking a whole bunch of nonsense. The film is a satirical take on the media, parenthood, politicians, scientists, society as a whole, and the tone of it was spot on. It's a fantastic movie. It provides an excellent commentary on society today. Now, Iron Man lives in a block that used to be a jail that they've transformed into houses. <laughs> it's not the sort of new building houses we're talking about. It's kind of, he's not in the deep slums of India, but he's not in the best parts. But across the road from here, you know that, that divide between the rich and the poor. You've got the big high-rise new buildings in the background. He knows his place in society and depicts this by calling himself 2G. 2G is second generation. And he gives this whole speech where he breaks down the different generations. First generation is his dad who never went to school. He's second generation. He had an education, but he never understood the importance of education and you've got the 3g and the 4g i won't go into it fully but it breaks it down excellently in the film and it's something that i've never thought about before but it rang true for me personally and i'm sure it will for other people whose parents or grandparents started very poor but then as you've moved through the generations it gets better for them and so he recognizes himself as a 2g but he's desperate to try and change this and he thinks his son who's a child genius is his way out of this and he'll use him at all costs one of the areas it touches on in india is actually skin tone i wasn't aware that this was an issue in the indian community the way it is in a black community where his son is being interviewed for tv and they're trying to put makeup on him to make him seem a bit loud i didn't realize that indians face the same issues as black people do about their skin tone that was just one of many intriguing scenes that made me realize a lot of similarities between indians and black people you've got scientists who are investigating things that don't really matter that are bamboozled in people to get public funds <laughs> there's a press conference and there's a funny exchange between the scientists and some of the journalists and he essentially says if you understood what i was saying you would be me <laughs> it's a brilliant way to get out of any situation when you think you're the smartest guy in the room it takes aim at the research society and some of the ridiculous theories that they come up with there's some researchers that they spend millions of pounds on which are obvious you didn't need to tell me that me eating chicken and chips every day is going to lead to me being obese why are you going to spend money on that <laughs> and iron's relationship with his wife is very lovable it's very relatable it reminded me of my relationship the banner that they have between the two is hilarious however this film is not just comedy throughout it does have its serious moments which are both intense and very sad it explores a lot of dynamics of a father and son relationship and shows the pressures that we put on our kids as parents it's almost like we're living our ambitions out through our kids and it tells a very dangerous story of what might happen in those situations and that's what i loved about this film it made me reflect on many things that are happening on life many things that are happening in my relationships and even though my son is only three it did make me think the ambitions that I had in my head, I can't push him into that. We're always going to have expectations of parents of our kids. But what does that actually translate into? And this film really does make you think about those topics. The acting in this movie was stellar. The son, Addy, gave an excellent performance. There's one particular scene where he just takes over a whole conference and you think, wow this is powerful but very believable at the same time. It's something to be said about child geniuses and how we treat him. The ones who plays Iron, he gave an outstanding performance. One of the best I've seen by Mel Leeds this year. He's probably not gonna get recognized in the Oscars because it's an Indian film, but he held down every single scene he's in. He's inviting, he's gripping, he's funny, he's charismatic. 
excellent. And his character art from beginning to end was brilliant. It was spot on with the way society works today. Overall, this film was excellent. There were so many gems and thoughts sprinkled throughout the movie that just resonated with me. There were a few nuances that I didn't fully understand because I'm not Indian. However, 95% of the topics and themes translate. The only issue I had with the film was that some of the supporting characters were a bit underwritten. There are people that come into the film at various points that are just a bit underwritten. I would like to know a bit more backstory. So that could have been fleshed out a bit more. But aside from that, Netflix, you've done it again. Four stars. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and check out some Marvel videos.